up here and I actually colored that in blue in the bottom because that's what I want to focus on. Um, here, this statement here could vary, it could change to different things, right? Like you can say, I like guys, I like friends, okay? I like people. So that could vary, you could change that to whatever you want. You can have another phrase there, like I uh, like to hang around people, I like to be with friends, etc. That phrase could change, not just necessarily I like guys. And then they aren't too serious. Um, in this case, I want you to notice that we're using adjectives. All right? So whenever you use adjectives, what you're going to have in this uh, second statement is going to be uh, the verb to be either positive or negative. Okay? Um, and then, the, and then that's going to follow the adjective. And so what I want you to notice at this time is how we take these two pieces of information and we combine them together with the usage of the relative pronouns who or that. So let me give that example now. I like guys who aren't too serious. I like guys that aren't too serious. Now, what I want to explain here is that you can either Tell you. Hi, good evening, teacher. Good evening. How are you? I'm doing fine, teacher. Thank you. What what about you? I'm doing good, doing good. I say it's the last oh, day. I I yeah. I wonder who's going to come. Yes, indeed, it's the last day. You know. But uh, well, I hope I hope we will see next week. Yeah. Um maybe next week. No, I think maybe October 4th. October one? October fourth. Oh, October the fourth. Oh, okay. I think okay. because normally it's two weeks. Normally oh. it's two weeks for, for the activities. Oh, okay. Oh, I thought that it would be a nice week. Okay, it could be all right. Mm -hmm. yeah. yeah, we have time to, to review what, what we have been studying. That's right. The idea is because uh, many they, they need to organize the paper, organize the documents, make sure everything is in order. Oh, I see. Okay. Mm -hmm. all, right, all right. All right. So we have to be ready by by, by then. Yes. So that's why okay. I think. So, I, what, what are you going to do during those weeks? That's what we were going to talk about. That, uh, uh, that's an excellent question, Helio. What are you going to do? Oh, okay. I see. Well, well uh, for me, I'm going to continue studying, studying, reviewing what we, we have seen, writing it, because uh, uh, especially the sentences we have been uh, seeing, because, you know, the, 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 what should we call it, the, the order of the sentence, mm -hmm. you know, the formula, yeah, we have to, to stick on that. You know, it, because it is it, it, the main is the main key for for structuring sentences. So the, the 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 structure, the grammar order. Yeah, yeah, the grammar order. Yeah, that's the what I mean. The grammar order. Uh, okay. we, we have, uh, it's very very important because we whenever we we when I use uh, uh past participles past the past, simple past in, in gerunds, so it's necessary to, to practice all those sentences. Yeah, yeah, because it is the way, it's the way we, we, we have to, you know, to, how to say it, it's the way to, the, the have the right use for, for this word. We have to we have to write. It will happen. Yes, yes, you are right. Um, let's see. We also have a hey, Roxana and Jose. Good evening. How are you? Good evening, teacher. I'm good. Thanks. Great. How was your weekend, Roxana? Uh, it was good. A little 
tired. <laughs> Too many activities. Yeah. But today you feel good. Yes, I'm good. Okay. We were talking with Helio about the next course uh, because we don't have a, a, a date when the next course is going to begin or what happened. I told Helio, usually it's a few weeks. Usually it's two weeks to, for the next course to begin. So maybe in the week of October 4th, uh, because this week and then next week for the documents, for the reception, for human resource, for the INSA for the different things or for the different companies, depending. And then maybe, I think maybe October 4th, we begin the next module. And Helio, the question Helio had was how, what do we do for the next two weeks? And I say, excellent question. What do you do? How are you going to, what, how are you going to continue improving your English for the two weeks? Or are you going to relax? Are you going to wait? What are you going to do? Um... I would like to relax a little. <laughs> yeah. You look a little tired, a little tired. Yes, I am exhausted today. <laughs> yes, yes, yes. And, and sometimes it's necessary. One week vacation, two week vacation. Ah, okay, no problem. Then you feel better and then return four weeks class 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 because it really is difficult the class is late it's nine o'clock yes it is. and we finish the class at 10 o'clock and then at 10 o'clock you you don't go to sleep you have to organize or do things or depending so i imagine you are tired you are tired for the next day so so maybe it's a good idea also roxana relax a little bit enjoy the small break Mm -hmm. <laughs> Thanks. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's good. It's good. And you, Jose, what do you imagine? How, what are you going to do the next few weeks? The next, the next few weeks. Um, I'm not sure, but I'm, but I think I I'm learning about the quick cryptocurrency right now. I watching some videos, uh, learning something. How does it work? Um, is not for Bitcoin. I, I mean, there is a, a there is exists different kind of currency, the cryptocurrency. So I try to learn. I try to know about them, and I would like to to try invest a little money just to see what happen. Um, for example, in the next six months later, maybe, or um, in a year. Okay. That's new for me, and, and I would like to know, I, I would like to have my own experience. And Jose, do you know anything about a cryptocurrency? Uh, I know a little bit, but I try to um, uh, investigate more, but in a slow way just to understand and then I will put my money there. Okay. Okay. I think that in, in, in Netflix, they have a series for cryptocurrency or no? I, yes. And, and the two, two is um, there is a person that has that suppose there is an expert about the currency and as I said before, there, there is, exists a lot of cryptocurrency. So um, I try to uh, um, how can I say that? I investigated yesterday and this weekend, and I found that it exists NTFs that is a game. So um, if I play that game, first I need to put my money, right? But if I play on that game, I'm going to earn money. Imagine that. Okay, okay. So yeah. I'm going to play a video game and I'm going to earn money. Like, yeah. uh, um, it's supposed that is $10 for three hours. Mm -hmm. 
it's supposed, right? I, I don't have my own spirits, but that's that I I going to try. Okay. I know that that I can lose money. I know that I can earn money. That's true. That's true. There are two forms. Um, uh, but NTFs is not about um, it's not about video games. It's it's NTF is the digital is the digital property. Uh, yeah, but there is exist uh, uh, games. Yes, it can exist with games, but it's not it's not for games. For example, it can be it's not for only games, right? It's not exactly. It's not only for games. You can buy art, you can buy pictures, you can buy digital media, and you have the NTFs. Yeah, mm -hmm. yes, that's true. Yes, if you like cryptocurrency, maybe it's a good idea to look at Ethereum. Ethereum maybe is a cryptocurrency that is, is more stable and then maybe you would like. All right, that's fine. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna investigate about that. Yeah, uh, I saw uh, different kind of, for example, uh, ADA, mm -hmm. uh, Ethereum, Bitcoin, uh, Solana. Uh, there is different kind of cryptocurrency. Yes, yes, yes. They have one that's called Dogecoin also. There's a lot. Yeah. Uh, there's a lot of cryptocurrency. Like, uh, yes, I think that is uh, like a 200, right? Yes, the, the problem with cryptocurrency is like money. There are quetzales, colones, eh, pounds, dollars, but the cryptocurrency, the the Bitcoin is like the dollars in the real world, is the standard. Yeah. And then they have the other currencies. Yeah, true that. But as I say, I trying to investigate about that and just to have my own experience. Just going to put, I, I planned, right? I have the plan that I'm going to put like a 15 or $20 and see what's happened in a few months later. Hey, yeah, why not? Yeah, why not, right? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, right. So, is, it is, I always think it's not the same that someone tells you that you experience and you try. Yes, yes. That's, right. that's my then, point. Mm hmm because, for example, uh, I can tell you, hey, this is excellent. Do it, do it. But it's not the same if you don't try, because then you don't realize. Or maybe yeah. I, ah, it's really difficult. It's really hard. And for you, maybe it's not. It's, it's always, I think, you need your own experience. Yes, that's good. And I, I try. For example, I, I don't know if you have already uh, the Chivo app. I don't want it, uh, I, Chivo. Ah, the yes. From the government. I, yes. I don't want it from um, September, the first week. Mm -hmm. But nowadays, the, the app works almost perfectly, but have some issues too. And I try to send money, to receive money, to make an exchange from the dollar to Bitcoin and everything about the app. And I try to explain to another person. And for example, there is somebody, I have the $12, uh, can you buy it? Yes, why not? I have the cash here, send me the money, send me your Bitcoins and whatever. And in the app, I can change from the Bitcoin to dollars. So it's the same if I have my, for example, my bank account. I can send the money that I have in the app Chivo to my bank account. So I don't know why the people say the government is gonna have my all my, my all information. They have already. So I don't see the problem if you can use the app or not. But anyway, I I trying to. To use that, I, On the I already. That I... Mm -hmm. Sorry, no, no. I I was going to say I already spent all my chivo money. The chivo money is gone. <laughs> <laughs> I received my chivo money and I spent, and yeah. I did more and I spent. And I erased the app, right? <laughs> 
Yeah, I do, now I don't need an app. Why? Yeah. No, it's not necessary. I, I went to the supermarket and Super Selecto has said Chivo. Okay, I pay with Chivo. Yeah, my parents has a, has a little restaurant in Apulo and I explained on this weekend and Saturday how they can use it. And I said, hey, you can receive a payment using that app. That's fine. Just to verify that you receive the money and that's it, right? Why not? It's the money. It's the same if you receive dollars for cash or something like that. You can use it. And they say, all right, we're going to try. Yeah, why not? The, the important is, uh, you, you, I think what you are doing is important, Jose. Before you invest, before you make the money, research, investigate, have some idea. But that way you make less mistakes. That way you don't, yeah. some of the mistakes that you can avoid, you can learn about. Yeah. Yeah, that's true. Okay. Well, I'm glad. I'm glad, Jose. Okay. Thank you. So I see all of us have some things. What we're going to do is we're going to make small groups and we're going to talk about our childhood. And we're going to start talking today's topic is what did you do? What games did you play? For example, it, when you were growing up, did you play uh, Mika? Mika in English is called tag, okay? For example. Tag. Uh, yes. Did you How do you spell it? it? It's in the tap. It's in the chat. Mm -hmm. Oh, tag. Mm -hmm. All right. Did you, okay. did you play Escondelero? Escondelero. Uh -huh. Hide and seek. I hide, hide and seek. Uh -huh. Okay. Or then. what did you do? You know, maybe... Uh, maybe you played with, uh, maybe you played the game with, with marbles or, or other things, okay? Well, what about Capirucho? Yeah. Capirucho is called Tops. Oh, Arranca tops. cebolla. Mm -hmm. Yeah. yeah. That's right. Arranca cebolla. Uh, that's the same, <laughs> because that one, they don't have in English. That one doesn't exist. The, the, the Tops is not the it, it, same as Trompo? <laughs> Correct. Que capirucho. Which one is Capirucho, Helio? Capirucho is the one that, that it has a it has a string and it yeah. tie in, it's tying in, in, a, in a little uh, wood stick. That's right. And try, and try That's to, tops. Tap. No, no, no. Tops. It's not the one that, that is thrown to, to the ground. Yes, you throw to the ground. Yes. No, no, this Capirucho, no. A producer is a little, a little gadget like, like this. Okay, like, like, like a carreton de, de, I, I have one on my side. I, let me show you. I have one on my side here. Okay. This is the one, I don't, can you hear it? Can you see it? Let me see it. Okay, okay, okay. Can you see it? And, the, the, and this is this is a little wood stick. This is the, the, the little wood stick, and then you you, you just play it. Yeah, you, you're trying to, to stick it into the into the, uh, the, the little. Uh, yes. That's called ca capirucho. For the mouth. That's capirucho. The, but the top is the one you you throw to the ground, and it just spins on the on the ground. The, the trompo. That's right. But, That's the top. But not, not, not this one. Mm -hmm. the, 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 this is you have, you have to play by one, by one hand and stick it in. Okay. I, 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 I never tried before. I never played this before. I, I, I saw how, how they, they, they play, but I, I, never, I never learned how to, how, how to, to stick it in on the, on the wood stick. Yes, yes, yes. I, I used to play when I was young. I used to Oh, play. okay. That's Capirucho. Mm-hmm. So how how do you call it? It's the same because it's not it's not an American game. Oh, so like think for example, so for example, for us, uh -huh. Arranca Cebolla is only for uh -huh. us. Uh -huh. there, yeah, yeah. No, there is no Arranca Cebolla in English. The, you don't uh -huh. have the same for Americans, uh -huh. right? Okay. The Americans uh -huh. they yeah. have games that are called, for example, cans. 
they they have ah. teams that, uh, but we don't have in El Salvador cans. They, oh, really? We don't play this game. Mm -hmm. All right. Okay. Yeah, mm -hmm. that's, that's that's right. Yeah. So only because... the only the only the big games that are, big. for example, like a uh, cops and robbers, mm -hmm. hide and seek. These are the international games, and then oh really? The the local games? No, they don't have mm -hmm. for for us. Mm -hmm. Oh, oh really? Oh okay. Mm -hmm. So it's very interesting to know, you know, knowing all all this all this vocabulary. That's right. Yeah. There's a game called hopscotch. I put I see Leticia put in in there for <laughs> Hush, hashback. It's in the chat. Hopscotch. Hopscotch. Mm -hmm. Okay. All right. So, Let's see. We're, so we're going to start off um, with two activities, right? The activity is describe your childhood. What did you do? Uh -huh. uh, what games did you play? How did you spend your time? And, and then the second is how do you think the teenagers today, how do you think the new generation uses their time? What do they oh, do okay. their life? So it's two, right? One, talking about our past. Okay. And number two, talking about what the future is going to be. How is the oh. generation? Okay. Oh, okay. I see. Okay. We're ready? Okay. Let's try. Yeah. Okay, okay. All okay, we can okay. do is, that's right. Yeah. All we can do is practice. All right, let's do. Let's do it. disappear and we changed it to they uh, to and we changed it to who or we changed it to that okay so all like guys who are into series this is on our first example let me talk about the second example now yeah. and the reason this one is different is because we're no longer going to use adjectives uh, so that changes a little bit uh, but again, it's the same concept as previously. What we want to do here is we want to combine two pieces of information. What are those two pieces of information? Well, I like guys. That's one piece of information. And then they have a good sense of humor. Now, in this case, notice that we're using a verb. Um, and that's because we're using a noun to uh, mention the kind of people that we like to hang around with. So I like guys or I like friends. I mentioned that you can change this to whatever you like. Um, that phrase could change to something else as well. So I like the way that you would change this is to say something similar will happen, and that is that uh, the uh, pronoun on the second uh, piece of information will disappear, and that will disappear by either who or by using that. So in other words, the statement will state, I like guys that have a good sense of humor or I like guys who have a good sense of humor. Now let me get you to do a few examples. I'm, we're going to do one last one together and then I'm going to have you do a few more. We want to take these two pieces of information. I like to meet people. They are sociable. So we got two pieces of information and what we want to do here is we want to put these two together. We're just going to remove the pronoun they and we're going to change it for a relative pronoun either who or that so that was quite simple i like to meet people who are sociable and i mentioned you can either say i like to meet people that are sociable the 
adjectives that best describe each individual. So let's get started by learning the adjectives that you see before you. I'll be making this document available so you can have it for reference. Easygoing. An easygoing person is someone who doesn't worry much or get angry easily. Egotistical. An egotistical person is someone who has a very high opinion of himself or herself. Inflexible. An inflexible person is someone who doesn't change easily and is stubborn. Modest. A modest person is someone who doesn't brag about his or her accomplishments. Sociable. A sociable person is someone who enjoys being with other people. Stingy. A stingy person is someone who doesn't like sharing. Supportive. A supportive person is someone who is helpful and encouraging. Temperamental. A temperamental person is someone who has unpredictable or irregular moods. Unreliable. An unreliable person is someone who doesn't do what he or she promised. Now, what we're going to do is we're going to listen to an audio program at this time. And as I mentioned, we need to be familiar with these adjectives in order for us to answer the questions from this audio program. What we're going to do in this audio program is we're going to listen to a description of Andrea, James, and Mr. Johnson. And then what I would like for you to do is to choose the best statement that describes each individual. So let's listen to that audio program at this time. So have you seen Andrea lately? Yeah, I see her once in a while. How's she doing? I've been meaning to call her. Well, to be honest, she's kind of been getting on my nerves lately. What do you mean? She's changed a lot since we've started college. She talks about herself. Time, and she always manages to mention how good she is at everything she does. Really? That would be annoying. It is. You know, she asked me to be roommates with her next semester, but I don't think I want to live with her. She used to be really generous, but now she's just the opposite. And it's not just with money, but her time as well. Well, college can be stressful. You two are good friends. Maybe you need to talk more. 
Are you going to James's party on Saturday? Of course. James always gives the best parties, and there are always lots of interesting new people to meet. It's true. I don't know where he manages to find them all. Well, you know what he's like. He makes friends very easily. He really likes talking to people, and he loves inviting people over. Uh huh. He invited me for dinner last Saturday. What a feast! Yeah, he's a great cook too. After dinner, I offered to help clean up, and he told me not to worry about it. He said he'd take care of it later. He was like, "It's nothing, no big deal." Yep, that sounds like James. Have you met the new apartment manager, Mr. Johnson? Yeah, I met him last week. He's a little strange. Yeah, he is. I'm not sure I like him. He's hard to predict. Sometimes he's pretty cheerful and talkative, and the next day he doesn't even say hello. I think he must have personal problems or something. I think you're right. And have you noticed that half the time when he says he's going to do something, he never actually does it? He told me three times he'd come to fix the light in my kitchen, and he still hasn't done it. I can say I don't mind it. All right. Okay. I don't mind it when someone gives me a compliment. Uh, okay. Perfect. All right, guys. So tell me, what did you find out about your partner? Roxana, what did you learn about your partner? Uh, uh, Jose told me that he used to play. Um, what, <laughs> uh, basketball. With in their the in his neighbor. And in the school. Okay. Only that. Only that. Wow. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> Jose, tell me about Roxana. Uh, we're talking about different different kind of games when we were a child, right? And we talk about the new generation from the, those days. <laughs> and uh, we said there is completely different because nowadays we can't see some kind of children playing the game that we played when we was a child. And for example, I... I... Jose, you're on mute. The mic. Jose. All right. Um, I mean, there is completely different of generation when we was a child and the new generation. For example, I say I try to to share my experience with my daughter, with Roxana, and I explain to her that my daughter has three years, and she is an expert using a smartphone. And I say, my God, right? And when I was a child, I just playing, I like it. I still like to play basketball or soccer. And that is different now that they, with, with the child. And my brother Roxana, she said that, that she play marbles. Marbles, how can I pronounce that? That marbles. is... Marbles, marbles, right? marbles. marbles. Yeah. she used to play marbles as you say that is for boys but she likes to play that okay hey that's good that's that's good many times 
the people saying, I know it's for boys, it's for girls, I don't play. So it's good that you played. <laughs> mm -hmm. But uh, I don't know if, if, if that, the, that the, the game that I play, I used to play, it's better than the, than the my niece and my nephew uh, play nowadays, it's better or, or, or no. I consider it depend on your generation. Oh, okay. Why, Roxana? Why do you think it's dependent generation is not better? Or... Yeah, I consider it's the same. For me, it's it's it was cool uh, to play my my kind of game, uh, marbles and and high and seek. But for my ne ne nieces and nephew, mm -hmm. it's better to play in their in their phone uh, because it's is is their time in their generation. It's the same for me. It's the same. It's not the one is better than the other one. It's depend on your time. Okay. Okay. Good. Good. Letty, what about you and your partner? What did you? Who was your partner? What did you discuss? My partner is a lion. <laughs> Elio. <laughs> Uh, is Elio at uh, the school he played Captain Robert Roberts? Mm -hmm. He had a lot of fun, they were friends games. Now, because it is more of the cluster online, not much personal interaction, interaction uh, with friends through communication and free friendships. Uh, friendships is lot um, less due to the lack of socialization even before the pandemic. Okay, all right, Letty. And, and, but this is for uh, the Helio before, he didn't socialize a lot. Let Sorry. Your microphone is off, Leticia. <laughs> yes, um, uh, because uh, it's more of the closer online, not much uh, personal interaction. Oh, uh, okay, okay. Helio, what did you learn about Leticia? Well, uh, first of all, we, we were talking about the, the current currency. Okay, the Bitcoin, mm -hmm. because uh, she has the same idea as, as the idea I keep up at now, because I, I really, I don't want to take chances knowing really, really what, a, what is this Bitcoin is about. So I better to be careful until I, I get the, the more information I get, so I'm going to decide if I'm going to do. So, so, so she, th she thinks the same I, as I do, okay? Because uh, uh, she says for her, Bitcoin is not good. It was, it was she says, you know, but uh, I could say, yeah, it might be good. I say I might be, because really I, I, I have no really, a, a clear idea of how it's going to it's going to work. So what I want to do is like I said, tell her to to be looking around, talking to people who who plays with it, and so I can take my my own decision. Okay. So anyway, if we if we were talking about that, but then we we went to when she was a child. Her childhood, she says she likes to play the uh, girl games, like uh, even, but I see she told me once that she played soccer. No, but in those, day, in those times, I think uh, football for uh, 
who was so good for girls, he, never, he, he was not very common, common, common game. So, but I, I surprised me because really I didn't, I didn't know they could be, he could, be, she could be playing as a football soccer. But, uh, but uh, then she says she, she likes to play uh, marbles, uh, she can hide, or she can heal, whatever you do. Know. And mm -hmm. the other hash, hash catch, what's the Macaulay? Hash, hash catch? He says she played, uh, she played so. And uh, even she, when she was uh, at school, she still kept kept uh, playing those games because they, they, she liked to very much those. This is what I learned from her. Okay, yeah. All right, good, good. And you're right, you're right, Helio, before, it's not so common to watch the girls play soccer. Now, yeah, that's, normal. Yeah. now it's normal, but before, it's not so common. Mm -hmm. Yes, that's right. Yeah, true. Okay. Yeah, he was, he was a member of he, he was, he told me. Yeah. All right. Thank you. Thank you guys very much. Elena, tell us about your partner. Okay. Uh, my partners uh, were Monica and Elwin. I uh, share about Elwin. Elwin uh, shared with us a, uh, he, Played with uh, marbles and um, arranca cebolla <laughs> and, <laughs> and something like that. And he watched a uh, heavy and um, messenger C <laughs> in the TV. Is a uh, 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 he say uh, is a uh, like it very much heavy. <laughs> Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay all right good good okay uh, monica tell me about elena well elena say uh, she play a lot of girls games like uh ule and she wash washed a lot of uh, TV shows like uh, Thundercats, Garfield, Candy Candy, and others, and others <laughs> um, pro, oh, TV show programs the, for the kids. And I, I say her, uh, she like, um, many TV shows like uh, my older brothers and I remember kind of um, a messenger C and um, Silver Hawk and the others the Turtle Ninja and the others TV the shows <laughs> the Flintstones <laughs> is good. Oh, good it's an institution uh -huh. <laughs> yes, I I say I I say here, uh, kind of the Flintstone is uh, a TV show or a program for the all the all the age. I saw the Flintstone in my in my uh, when I I when I have um I remember when I. I have a remember for the eight, uh, eight years old. And I saw uh, many years uh, when I, I, when I have a 20 years old and many years, the time, uh, I saw so. <laughs> Like that, and um, Edwin, he say, uh, he saw um, more for the Heidi because he's a, uh, in this moment, is a popular program. And I remember I saw the, the Caballeros del Zodiaco. Mm -hmm. And 
Dragon Ball Z <laughs> and the mm. others uh, contemporaneous. <laughs> <laughs> okay, all right, good. Edwin, tell me, what did you learn about Monica? Uh, uh, se, botella en vene. She say she doesn't remember the rules, but the only remember the name, but she say again. He actually they see a for TV so the like Like for like candy, like Haiti, like Playstone. Are you listening? Yeah. Yes, only it's a little difficult, Edwin. A little difficult to hear you because you we hear and then it stops and then we listen again. Yeah, it does. Maybe Edwin. Uh, maybe it's a vaccination because it's it is raining. That's why. That's maybe uh, why. Yes, when it rains. Maybe. Difficult to connect. Yeah, but Ramonica says he, he had a play when she was a lady, a small lady, uh, La Botella Envenenada. <laughs> La Botella Envenenada. Yes. Botellita Envenenada. Well, Botellita Envenenada. Yeah, well, <laughs> and so, uh, when, some, uh, when they play oh, when the, in the group and and the, when some puppy, I don't know when she doesn't remember the ruler, but she only remember the name, but but eat and venenada. And when somebody captured, I don't is know. it your favorite play? I don't know this game. I don't know. No, no, I never heard about it. I say game. the same to the Monica. I never heard that, 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 yeah, I that never game. Heard. I never heard about that game. It's, yeah, hell you it's really. like a. It's a, like a tag when uh, the uh -huh. difference is uh, the people take the fingers from the one person and the, this one person say one name the other the other play player jugador yes player uh -huh. the other player and when the when the 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 um, uh, I, I don't don't remember very well when the the central person say the name the other player the one or the the other player and you 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 uh, the player can, run ah uh, yes <laughs> Uh, you must run and no, uh, no, debe dejar que te atrape couch. You, for example, I say Roxana and I run for Roxana. Yes. And the other, uh, and, no, uh -huh, Roxana, she, she, she can run, 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 <laughs> and if. Um, uh, I don't remember very well the rules when it is uh, uh, like uh, a attack when you play if you play the attack or the the um, like like uh, ladrones y policía mm -hmm. uh, you can I think the do. other people only saw and left and, and left <laughs> with the people wrong. <laughs> yes, yes. yes, I think so because if you say the name and then the other people they don't worry, they don't have to run. Yes. You must run and not get caught couch. Uh-huh. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. If you do not um 
she don't move for uh, yes you don't move um i i remember you don't move and the other people who uh, and the other people can don't touch the the can take the entre comillas the uh, empotita envenenada um, you must how do you say pasará how do you say what Monica uh, pass down between the legs yes mm -hmm. and sorry monica you have bad connection oh. it's on yes, yes. so you don't <laughs> yes. <laughs> yes sorry i have a, a bad connection because I, 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 in the in the border have a, a many turned off for light. Okay, okay, mm -hmm. no problem, no problem. I I never heard the game. I'm not sure. <laughs> I don't mm -hmm. know how it works, but I have the idea that now you is like. It's like tag and you only the you have to say the name of the person. So okay. Well, it's good. Now the important is that we are practicing, we are talking about it. And what do you think? How is it going to be for the next generation? Roxana says that for her is not better, it's not worse. It's only different. Each generation is different. For for our generation. The activity was go outside and play, go invent, go do something, right? Never exist. I, I am bored because if you are bored, you create a game. You look for your friends, you go out. But now it's very common, very common that people say, I know, I'm bored. There is nothing on TV. There's nothing to watch. All of these bored. Mm -hmm. What do you think for the next generation? They are going to continue with the cell phone, with the uh, social media, or they re or they go back, or they do some exercises. What do you think? I think it's like uh, Roxana is a, a different, but it's not bad because in our time we can go out and play in the street with the uh, the neighborhoods. Uh, but now for the for a security problem the the girls and the boys can go out and stay safe for playing because it's a uh, insecurity for girls and boys for equal um i think they spend the time with the other activities maybe like the yes for example the the cell phones with the social networks or with a chat but others youngest people play online and interact with the others uh, with the others youngers uh, and the and the difference with us is the we interact with the neighbor but today some some boys and girls interact with the boys and girls of the other countries. Maybe depend of the the orientation for the parents for to they can spend the time or maybe someone like to read a book, maybe or see movies, something like that. I think it's uh, different because the technology is different too. Okay. Yeah, you are you are very uh, right, Elena, in the comment about that now. Before the the friends were the neighbors, 
the people and the things. And now many friends, they are international. Oh, my friend in China, my friend in, in Brazil, my friend in, in Spain, because they play a lot of games online. You, this is very, very different, the concept. Because for us, it, the friend was the person you know. <laughs> mm -hmm. Concept friend is completely different. Yeah, right. Okay. Leticia, what did you want to say? Mm, in my opinion, mm -hmm. I remember I remember that uh, uh, when I said the Tamagotchis, <laughs> going bored, going bored, but uh, quick, quickly, mm -hmm. and they died because they were uh, uh, replaced, re replaced, replaced, replaced. Be? Mm -hmm. Replace be a smartphone and the multiple game in a different application. Okay, okay. So they re you think they're going to replace with the smartphones? Uh, with uh, but the smartphone uh uh are um, different games uh. Uh, different more more the more the more more the more application and different um, forms the um, hacer las cosas hacer to do, to do the thing mm -hmm. oh, okay okay but let me say the, the the tamagotchi is replaced with the smartphone <laughs> because of the the technology evolution. Someone, I don't have a Tamagotchi, but my husband, he had a Tamagotchi. <laughs> I don't, I never have a Tamagotchi. Uh, I never play with a Tamagotchi. I don't know what is the feeling. It's a, a virtual pet. <laughs> uh, yes, yes, yes. I remember now uh, that you have like to give food, you have to take care of and, and do these things. Yes. <laughs> okay. Yes, it's completely different. So, it's, sometimes it's good and bad, the technology. For example, is like in the English, because with technology, imagine now, now you can have uh, classes online with different parts of the world, with different instructors from different countries or from different areas. You can practice like uh, we have from the, in the, in the chat that I think Roxana was the one who sent uh, or for practicing online uh, listening, different things, right? So there are some benefits. There are some benefits that maybe it's not exactly the same friends, but now, we don't have time for the friends. Not like before, before we spend a lot of times, but now no. Now think about it because you are going to have maybe two weeks, maybe more where we don't have classes. And it's important, how are you going to use your time? Yes, it's important to relax and wait and, and recover energy, but also it's important not to forget your English. Imagine maybe, the next course in one month? I don't know. <gasps> wow. And what do you do for one month? Only watch Netflix, only watch uh, uh, social media, no? So I hope that this idea is to help you also so that you are thinking about A, in the next course or in the between now and the next course, what you're going to do, okay? Yes, teacher. Yes, teacher. I, I don't know. Yes, Roxana. I don't know, but I uh, uh, I have a little problem to speak, and I and I have listened uh, a, 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 a music in English music and, and watch some movies in English. But when I try to speak, I have problems. 
and I don't know. I I feel like uh, I uh, como que retrocedido. I don't know how can I say no, that. No, sure I watch. I sure I try to watch some movies in English or only only in English. Only when I watch when I watch. Uh, TV with my mother, I watch in Spanish, but when I, I stay alone, I watch only in English, but I have problem to speak and I don't know why. Okay. It is natural. It's natural, Roxana. But the thing is, uh, it's not the same as uh, watching watching movies, listening to music, but it's not the same as uh, to speak in it. You have to practice to practice with it to, to find some someone to talk to in English and talk back in English too. So you can listen. You can you can practice the the, the at the, the same rest. time. At the same time, yeah. yeah. Because yeah. because it, because it happened to me. I I can write. I I could read it. I could write it. But at the time when I try to 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 apply my speaking, I had some some barriers. I couldn't go further <laughs> than the barrier. But so it's a I little frustrating, yes. right? <laughs> yes, yes, indeed. But uh, that, that, that frustration gives you uh, gives you more courage in order to to overcome that frustration. That's what happened. That's yes. a problem. Yeah, yes. yeah you, you, I, I think. You had, and the uh -huh. practice, practice I think it is uh, master, I think. Uh, and you try to speak English, but don't translate because uh, I think it's a mistake because uh, we try to speak and first we think in Spanish and later translate to speak in English and we Indeed. need to speak in English directly. It's not yes. it's, it's, uh, avoid the process to translate the Spanish yes. to English is, is something uh, is try to speak English naturally. Uh, I think it's, uh, it's a mistake in, in everyone's community. I, I think so. Yeah, and the, well, the thing is uh, the time you go and to apply your speaking, you don't have to think to think in Spanish. That's no, you don't have to. That mm -hmm. because that, I, I, that, that I try to avoid, but I don't know. <laughs> Uh -huh. <laughs> what is my problem? <laughs> no, it's, yeah, my no, no, because it's for everybody. It's for everybody. The, the importance yeah. that we practice, yeah, yeah. the importance yeah. that we continue to practice, even if we have a small vacation, continue to practice. Even if we have a small vacation, continue to practice, watch videos, yeah. continue to improve. That's right. I, I want to thank all of you for being in the class, for making the effort, because I know it's difficult. I know it's hard. To mm -hmm. class every day. Imagine only today didn't come to class the last day. It's difficult sometimes. Mm -hmm. It's difficult. It is. I thank you for coming and I hope to see you in the next module. Okay, teacher. Uh, thank you. Thank, thank, you. You. thank, thank you. Thank you, teacher. Bye. For bye. 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 Bye, Elio. Bye, Elio. Bye, Elio. Bye, Elena, por todo. Bye, Monica. Bye, bye. Bye. Bye, Jose. Bye, bye. See ya. I hope to see you in the next course. Don't cry. I hope so. Yes.